Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Well, some day ago, I shoot a video about this brand new pedal that is the MXR in Big Mountain Overdrive. So, um, if you want to see the unboxing and uh, the test, the first test, you can uh, take a look to my YouTube channel. And by the way, I want to point one thing uh, in that review. I used this pedal alone with a flat sound and a clean sound on my uh, Marshall um, amplifier. So, guys, this was just a test to hear how it sounds. Uh, because, uh, as I told, uh, at uh, around a minute 10 of that video, um, I want to, uh, to include this pedal in my pedal board. So, I was not supposed to use this, um, this pedal alone when I play it live. And, uh, so, this was a misunderstanding. So, uh, and uh, uh, well, today I was uh, about to insert this pedal in my pedal board, and uh, I found an issue. And uh, uh, now I want to show it to you. Well, wait a moment. Another thing that uh, I wanted to point out is that uh, I wanted to review and to hear this pedal alone because someone told me that this pedal uh, was extremely noise so I wanted to hear uh, if uh, this was true because uh, in my pedal board I have uh, also a noise suppressor but uh, there I have also an Ibanez uh, uh, TS9 that is uh, does uh, a lot of uh, noise so I wanted to avoid that noise with this noise because I don't want to go to play live with a total mess in my pedal board so uh, with all that said I will show you what is the issue that I saw and uh, well, for someone can be uh, an issue, uh, not so important issue, but uh, for some other people it can be uh, an important issue. And now I want to show you why. So here we are. This is my pedal board. It's a Boss BCB60. I have six pedals inside here uh, the, the settings that you see are not the settings that I use when I play live uh, because uh, <clears throat> um, I just uh, came back from uh, a gig in uh, Denmark uh, we went there by plane so I, I had to to pick up outside all the stumps and uh, I didn't carry with me the full pedal board. So this is the new MXR Ingvi Malmsteen Overdrive and uh, I want to talk to you about uh, an issue, the issue that I found with this pedal and I found this issue this morning when I was about to mount it to put it inside the pedal board. By the way, uh, please don't tell me you should put this here, you should put this here, you should put this here and so on, because guys, with this pedal board, uh, I played hundreds and hundreds of gigs all around Europe, so uh, carried, carrying these pedals on the planes, on trains uh, and uh, uh, on buses so please this is the right configuration for what I play I play music uh, of the 80s and uh, I studied a lot 
sounds mm -hmm. and uh, uh, with the, the configuration of the pedal board. So please don't tell me this is supposed to be here, this is supposed to be here, please, because I don't care. <laughs> so let's go to the point. I wanted to to substitute <coughs> this boss pedal with this and uh, well let's go let's try to do this sorry <laughs> because uh, well I I want to test uh, this uh, kind of new overdrive instead than this one on my next uh, gig that will be in some day on uh, Saturday so I put the input here and everything's fine I put the output here and everything is fine and then this is the issue because uh, the AC adapter the AC line doesn't go here in uh, every other pedal that I have the AC line is here so I ask you and I ask <laughs> to the MXR and the Dunlop why didn't you put the AC input line here so what I have to do the I have two options here or um, use uh, this kind of adapter to put uh, here or I have some way to to make this cable a little bit longer to put the cable here and uh, another thing is that the, the input is not on the upper side but it's in the downside so guys this is a, a, an extremely uh, extremely uh, little thing but uh, well why <laughs> I don't know why they did this in this way because uh, for me this makes no sense at all so I think that uh, the option for me for the next Saturday will be to, to use uh, one of these uh, AC adapter and then I will uh, mm, I will try to to put this cable here on this side but uh, the the problem is that uh, well now I have uh, some space here to put this cable but um, this is not so obvious obvious because uh, if you have uh, if you have another kind of pedal board you can you could could have uh, less space here so it would be an extremely extremely uh, different kind of a problem a kind of bigger problem so i want to tell to Dunlop uh, and the MXR that uh, you have to do like this so you have to put uh, the AC DC input here in the front or here and uh, well not definitely not here because uh, it can be a serious problem so guys, please tell me your opinion about the issue that I found on this. So uh, what do you think, if you think uh, that I'm right or uh, if you think that uh, this is right to put the AC 
input adapter here. And uh, with all the said, leave me a comment. And with all the said, let's see you on the next video. Bye.